guy now. No, actually, I'm a Kirkland Kirkland uh, seltzer. So should we? Should we <laughs> yeah, they do, and they're they're good. They give me a horrible hangover after like two. All right, let's get started. Let's get started. I got my notes together. All right, let's give what the people. So I was thinking we can. Uh, I'll just do the the little news because we'll try and keep this within ten minutes, and then uh, we'll talk to you. And while we're talking, maybe you can like think of some interview questions for me or something. <laughs> Because you're actually coming on here to, to be interview me. You didn't, yeah. Oh, no, no. Fishmosh, uh, good surprise. We are doing a concert tonight. The boys are back there rehearsing, so just wait around till the end. It's going to be really good. Nope, not talking to you, talking to Fishmosh. Um, oh, that would be boring. Um, so this week... King Laser came out. Um, I can talk to you too, YouTube. I'll probably cut up to here because that first part was a lot of... Yeah. Um, but yeah, King Laser came out this week. Um, very exciting. Probably really heavy, really dirty. Uh, a lot of good dialogue started on that song. So it's kind of fun to watch. Um, I don't really have much to say about it other than I'm really happy that it's out and I'm really happy that folks dig it. It's got double the streams that SSRI had, which is really good news, and it got picked up by a huge-ass Spotify playlist. It's like 500,000 followers on um, new metal tracks, so that was the most exciting thing in the world, because we thought for sure SSRI would get playlisted, and it did not, so that was the wind in our sails. Uh, second thing I want to talk about is the fifth year anniversary of Future Golden Age. Soon to be the second best album ever released by this establishment. Um, this is 16 songs of pure... Um, I think it's just like the, the turning point in our band where we started writing good music. And we are giving away five of these copies today. So if you go to the Facebook or the Instagram, there's like a little thing, if like you tag a friend. But we'll ship them out to you for free. But yeah. So if you, have, if you don't have this record or if you know someone you want to put it in their stocking, um, just go like comment on those posts or something. There's, there's rules in the post, and, uh, and you can win them, and we'll just ship them out to you. Um, number three on the docket, um, we are finishing up getting ready for our third single, which is called Waiting. I'm going to show a little preview for it um, in just a second. But uh, yeah, ooh. Um, but yeah, it's going to be really good. I'm working on the music video right now, and the live parts are shot and done, but now I'm working on the story stuff, and it's a lot of like computer graphics, and so I'm still shooting parts of the story up until probably a couple days from now, and then the single's going to come out in like two weeks, so that is going to be very stressful for me, but I think it'll be a really good video, and the song is really dope. It's not going to be, it's going to be less of a heavy song. It's more of like a sing-along song, but it's still like dark. Like nothing gets happy in this record. I mean, not happy, but like, I just think it's lame if something's like, you know, regular chords or something. So if, uh, without further ado, I'm going to play a little bit of this track for everyone here, and uh, then we'll keep moving. Can you hear this, Jamie? Yeah. You still hear it? Sad boys, that's right. Thank you. That's 
little preview. Cool. Yeah, this is the one we were banking on that would be the most listened to, I think. Yeah, yeah. So that'll come, I guess, the 18th. Yeah. So I'm really scrambling right now. But uh, I think we'll get it done, and it'll be a really good video. Jenny Jen is in it. Um, she's our friend for a long time, and she models and acts. And she did a really good job. No, not yet. <laughs> Number four. Um, oh, yeah, you got those two. This is, well, I'm interviewed. You, um, the last thing I just want to say is follow us on Spotify. That's all. That's We say it every time. You just go to your account, type in False Star, click follow. really helps us out. We're trying to get to 4,000 before next week, which is not a crazy huge amount of followers, but it every little bit helps. So thank you to all you guys who have done that. Have you done that, Jameson? Yeah. Okay. Thanks for supporting us. Um, and that's all I have for like news or updates for this record. Um, but yeah, this is all I do every night, just work on the record, and I'm very excited for it to come out. Da -da 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 -da. So Jameson, it sounds fantastic. It's going to be great. Um, yeah, and if you have any questions, anyone, just leave them in the comments. I had a couple questions written down, and I lost them in my notes. I couldn't find them, so I'm really sorry. And like two minutes before I hopped on, I was looking through Facebook and Instagram, and I couldn't find them. So, uh, yeah, I, no, not for you. Uh, just from other people that would have asked them. That were no, they didn't know you were coming on. So, Jay, the reason I have Jameson on tonight is um. <laughs> because he's a friend and also he's releasing a book very soon called Name Dropping. So the fact that he's releasing a book would um, put him in the classification of book writer. Um, that's, what, that's the official title of what you do, book writer. 